The people of Constantinople may keep their possessions. There will be no looting. In return, you will open the gates of the city and kiss the hands of our Sultan. Sultan Mehmet will be the one ruler of the Romans. I am the smooth stone, the smooth stone, the Al Mahdi is metaphorically the Jacob and this girl has so much faith. Let's get started with a scripture. These are all going to be in Zechariah, Zechariah three and nine for behold the stone that I have laid before Joshua upon one stone shall be seven eyes this is the guidance the al Mahdi will be guided behold I will engrave the graving thereof saith the Lord of hosts and I will remove the iniquity of that land in one day. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala tells us in the Hadiths that he will rectify the Mahdi in one night. And tonight is your night. Watch this. This little girl will teach you the power of never giving up. She wanted to kiss the Hajar Aswad, the black stone, but the security in the Kaaba didn't allow her they asked her to leave then she went back to her father and again she tried to go to the Hajar Aswad in the Kaaba and other people were also encouraging her to go then she ran to the Kaaba Hajar Aswad and this time the other securities they asked to let her go and kiss the Hajar Aswad she finally got the chance and they helped her to kiss the black stone and then she was happy and running back to her father so amazing subhanallah many a times people stop you but you need to now that clip was a huge step of faith and many of you still do not know what is the significance of kissing this black rock and your sins being wiped away. Me watching this short literally caused tears to pour. Because many of you still do not get it. The Bible says the stone that the builders rejected. The same has become the chief corner stone now this stone represents a person and the al Mahdi is a stone my dad name is Monty Brooks and I am Daquant Lamonti and that black stone on the corner of the Kaaba is a picture of the last and final messenger. The messenger of Allah, whom the prophet Muhammad, peace and blessings be upon him, told us about. Now watch this clip. 
this little girl will teach you the power of never giving up. She wanted to kiss the Hajar Aswad, the black stone, but the security in the Kaaba didn't allow her. They asked her to leave. Then she went back to her father and again she tried to go to the Hajar Aswad in the Kaaba and other people were also encouraging her to go. Then she ran to the Kaaba, Hajar Aswad. At this time, the other securities, they asked to let her go and kiss the Hajar Aswad. She finally got the chance and they helped her to kiss the black stone and then she was happy and running back to her father. So amazing, subhanAllah. Many a times people stop you, but you need to... This little girl, I'm a finder. I'm a finder. This girl has faith. And whoever put this video together was guided by the angels. Because I'm going to show you something. That stone that she kissed was me. She just kissed me. That's exactly what she did. Now, the stone is surrounded by silver. Because I am surrounded by Veras. Okay, I'm surrounded by Veras. And she kissed the black stone. She kissed Lamanti. Now I'm going to read some scriptures that are in the Bible. This is going to be Zechariah 13 and 1. In that day there shall be a fountain open to the house of David and to the inhabitants of Jerusalem for sin and for uncleanness. Now there's coming one from the house of David. And this man will be a stone. And just like you kiss the Kaaba stone and the sins are taken away, it's the same thing with Al Madi. So this girl, her faith is amazing. I'm literally just tearing up because Allah showed me this yesterday. How the stone that the builders rejected, and I don't expect this video to blow up right away, okay? Because I'm ahead. I'm ahead of people spiritually, and I see more than everybody down here. And this girl, all she did was she kissed me. I'm surrounded by Veras. I'm surrounded by nothing but Veras. And I am that black stone that she just kissed. Now the Bible says the stone that the builders rejected. The same has become the chief cornerstone. Now the prophet Muhammad, peace and blessings be upon him. He was a messenger of Allah. But he was not the father. He was not. The Al-Mahdi is. This is why even in the New Testament, it says, wherein we cry, Abba, Father. The prophet of Allah, who will come in his name as Al-Mahdi, would be the fountain that is open to the house of David and to all the inhabitants in this fountain would cleanse you from sin and uncleanness. So when I watched this video, tears was just rolling because she literally kissed me. My brothers and sisters, the Al Madi is here. The Al Madi is black, as seen in Song of Solomon 1 5 and 6. I am black but comely, O ye daughters of Jerusalem, as the tents of Kedar, as the curtains of Solomon. Look not upon me because I am black, for the sun hath looked upon me. My mother's children were angry with me. They made me the keeper of the vineyard. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala revealed to me that I was closest to Allah. He told me the Quran was my book. My name is Daikwan. 
And the Quran is on the Quran. And I am the Rasulullah of the Quran. The Prophet Muhammad, peace and blessings be upon him. He paved the way for me. Jesus was like the John the Baptist. He prepared the way for me. This is the same stone that if you fall on it, you will be broken. But if it falls on you, it will grind you to powder. In Deuteronomy 18.18, 18, the Bible tells you God will raise up a prophet like Moses. And it will come to pass that whoever will not hear this prophet, God will require it of him. I am that stone the builders are rejecting right now. And this stone has healing. This stone has cleansing. I am the stone. I am Daiquan Lamonte Clay. And this video clip touched me because this girl could see something. She kissed that black rock and she did not give up. And what I learned from this clip is Allah is going to bring me to the forefront no matter what. And Allah is telling me, don't give up. He knows I'm not going to give up. But he's encouraging me to encourage myself. Don't give up. Don't give up. A brighter day is coming, my brothers and sisters. A brighter day such as you've never seen on planet Earth. Now, I'm going to play this clip one more time. This little girl will teach you the power of never giving up. She wanted to kiss the Hajar Aswad, the black stone, but the security in the Kaaba didn't allow her. They asked her to leave. Then she went back to her father and again she tried to go to the Hajar Aswad in the Kaaba and other people were also encouraging her to go. Then she ran to the Kaaba, Hajar Aswad. And this time the other securities, they asked to let her go and kiss the Hajar Aswad. She finally got the chance and they helped her to kiss the black stone and then she was happy and running back to her father. So amazing, subhanAllah. Many a times people stop you, but you need to. I am the stone that is being rejected, that is surrounded by the silver and the silver is the Vera's, the Vera family. I am here. I'm divinely protected. Allah is going to use me to completely rid this earth of evil. Who is going to be the first to accept the Mahdi, the stone, the black stone? 